Hey beautiful YouTubers, it's Tess and I'm going to be working on several babies today. I have the Bajarni kit by Elisa Marks right here from my friend Mandy. And I have the Serenity kit by Laura Lee Eagles who will be for sale. Um, let's see, she's 500 artist to use plus 50 for a belly plate. It's 550 plus for the pants. So she's 750 bald and 850 with painted hair. And I have David by Tina Kui. And somewhere around 700. Oh, what is it? Ah, I can't do math today. 500, yeah, 625 bald and um, 725 with painted hair. And then. Don't know what I'm going to do with that will yet. I'm not going to offer it as a custom because it's more of a gray kit. So that means it's going to be kind of experimental. And um, don't know how she's going to turn out. But So she'll probably be an eBay baby. But I also have the Any kit by Lisa Marks over here. Make a perfect ethnic baby, I think. But I could go Caucasian too. And she would be 600 bald and 700 with painted hair. Uh, other artists who say they, other artists who are like really good at painted hair and really good at rooting say nobody ever asks for bald babies and they just, you know, give them the painted hair price or the rooted price, but I'm not used to that yet. <laughs> uh, let's see, and I finished Eliza by Donna Rupert for, to be on display in Modern Maternity. And one day I'll go get a non-bountiful baby kid and a little open-eyed baby that would look good in there. I had one in mind, but I forgot what it was. Anyway, I was wondering if you guys would be interested in some sort of like, maybe doing like a Google chat or something. And I do have my new desktop now. If you've seen my last video, you know that. But I lost a lot. Uh, there was a lot of data on my hard drive that I thought would be transferable because I'm pretty computer savvy and they said there wasn't much wrong with the hard drive, but I couldn't manage to get the data off it. I mean, there's my computer, I had to take apart my computer so I can get out the hard drive. And um, I need to get an optical disk drive before I can do this for my desktop, but um, I'm thinking about, oh, oh, anyway, I lost, sorry, my train of thought is all over the place. I, I lost all my data, so that means I lost my tutorial, so you three people who got the book tutorial, you're the only ones who are going to have it. So I think I might do a video tutorial this time. Um, I'd probably be able to profit a little bit more and offer it for cheaper than the $75 books. The book cost about 50 to make. Um, so depending on how many hours I put into the tutorial and how detailed it gets, I don't know. I'll figure it out. And I've got a, I've got this phone that can hold a lot of memory now. But um, if you have any suggestions, if you've ever made a tutorial, let me know about any websites that allow you to create ebooks or um, any kind of thing like that. And let me know what kind of tutorials you like to use. I mean, I've got the precious little baby dust DVDs. I love those. Older skin tone DVD. That is, I use this to make. I think Lilia was the very second doll that I made with that tutorial, and even the she stands pretty nice looking. Compared to my work now, she still like doesn't really stand out too much as a big older doll. And then I have this Kate Charles tutorial book, which I really, really love. And the great thing about a book versus a DVD is um, when you have a DVD, you're kind of on the spot. And I mean, yeah, you can throw some text into the movie and to further explain something that you might have missed or forgot to say in your dialogue. But I, I like how... Um, in this, it's HD, you know, HD photos. I'm not going to show too much of this because, one, it got to buy it. But, um, you know, they're really HD close-up pictures that show you exactly what you need to do. And text that has been edited and revised very thoroughly to best explain how to paint your doll. So, both are really, really effective and really, really nice. And I also like the Yvonne Nather tutorial which I think gave you links to private videos that you can only or unlisted videos that you can only see if you have the link um, 
so like that was a combination of video and text and that was really cool and just skimming through that helped me so much I still have yet to like go through it in depth uh, so let me know what you guys want to see and all right, I'm not gonna make up their prices in my head again. But the dolls are, the dolls are, newborns are 500 plus the price of the kit plus ship. Lance are, used to be 50, well I guess I can still offer 50. 50 for like Walmart, Target, Layette, and that'll get you about three outfits. And 75 for a fantastic modern maternity Layette. And um, those are the minimum prices. You can always give me more and I'll spend as much as you give me. Um, but Modern Mater Maternity is a local store run by, um, my friend who I babysit her kids and, um, she's a, I'm pretty good friends with her family. <sighs> but yeah, those are all the babies. I, if you didn't see my last video, Rebecca's on eBay, Andy's on eBay. I just have to put these eyes in Meredith. This is just one of them. I'm just going to put these eyes in Meredith because she only has acrylic ones right now. And I guess they've kind of molded to be kind of oval and that's the only thing that's fitting with her. So, grab some oval eyes. So, she'll be on eBay next and then Phoenix probably at the same time. I've been addicted to the bidding even though I typically get... I, I prefer to get more than I would want for them because I mean who doesn't and there's eBay fees and stuff. Um, but I typically seem to get the price I wanted on eBay, which is nice. I mean, I guess you're going to have dolls that are going to go over and you're going to have dolls that are going to go under, but I like the re reliability of the bidding because it ends in five days and typically people pay pretty fast afterwards. Uh, but this video is dragging along. Let me know what you think about the tutorial. You can email me at testttucker at gmail.com. I always try so hard not to say testy tucker, like testies. <laughs> But, um, yeah, testttucker at gmail.com if you're interested in David by Tina Kiwi or Serenity by Laura Lee Eagles. I'm not taking customs right now unless I've previously talked to you about scheduling a custom for the summer because I am starting, I'm starting a new job in a week and I don't know how much time I'll have to devote to reborning yet. So I think it's mostly going to be eBay babies that I'm going to spread out and try to keep a profit going. So, sorry for the rant. Um, maybe I'll go put a bra on and <laughs> fix my hair a little bit and do some uh, painting and talking videos because you guys seem to like my last one. Love you guys. Bye.